Well, hello there. Come on in. I'm Chris Brown. I'm your humble chimney sweep. I was just going over your chimney inspection report, but now that you're here, make yourself comfortable. Let's go over it together, shall we? Okay, now let's take a look at the inspection report and see how it reads out. This is a generic report. This is exactly what you will get, only your information obviously will be filled into all these blanks. The upper right hand corner of the report is the legend. Each one of these initials pertain to something. A is consistent with the age of the chimney. B, C comments below. C, repairs needed. D, need further evaluation or E, not applicable. And they're placed into the boxes next to the parts of the chimney that can be easily identified in this diagram. And then of course you'll find my comments here below. Now let's take a look at your particular, your personal report. So stay with me. Hey Rhonda, what a great looking house. It was good to meet you and uh, meet with your client uh, out at the house today. Um, doop -a -doop -a -doop. Let's take a look at the top of the chimney. So we can see there's a lot of rust going on up here. And this, um, all of this rust and stuff, th this chimney uh, cover, this uh, chase top cover, uh, was not great to begin with. It was certainly uh, contractor's grade. It was made up on the spot. You can see where they had to caulk and caulk around the pipe that uh, protrudes up the smoke uh, pipe here um, to keep it from leaking. So I don't think there's anything here to save. I think what uh, it needs to be done now is it should be just replaced. And um, tip top over in Rock Hill, they'll fabricate you a brand new one. Uh, chimney cap itself could probably be saved. Uh, a little paint on the uh, chimney cap would probably save that. Hey, we've got an open fireplace in here. We don't have any logs, any artificial logs, but we do have a working grate at the bottom. You can see how it's working. It's got a controller and everything. I'm missing a handle on the controller, but that's pretty easy to come by. Uh, these logs can be purchased at any of your fireplace shops. Uh, Amazon.com, I think, uh, could handle that for you as well. Nothing to do uh, as far as installing. You're just going to set them right in place and use them. And... Uh, and that's great. And they're not spewing out any carbon monoxide today. We, we checked that out. Uh, working damper, this little bit of buildup is just on the damper, not, not really up in the flue system itself. So it doesn't even need to be cleaned, to be honest with you. Um, so that looks like about that. And if you folks have questions for me, give me a call. 704-526-6348. You can email me at chris at affordablesweep.com. Thanks.